Today, I am here with a review of the Femi Cycle Menstrual Cup. The Femi Cycle Menstrual Cup is a unique menstrual cup with many unique features. It also has a design unlike any other menstrual cup currently on the market. Here is my Femi Cycle Menstrual Cup when it's removed from the pouch. As you can see, this cup does not look much like traditional menstrual cups. It has a very different design and many different features, which I will be explaining to you. I find this is the original size Femi Cycle. It also comes in a low cervix version, which is very much like this, but just in a more compact version. And there's a teen version, which is just like this cup, but downsized completely. It has an interesting removal ring, as it has this hoop to remove it. But don't try to use this hoop just on its own to remove it. You still have to slide your finger up, break the suction, and then you can use the, the hoop to remove it. Otherwise, you're going to cause yourself a lot of pain. One very unique feature of this cup is that it has a no-spill rim. As you can see, the no-spill rim pulls out so that you can easily empty any waste out without getting messy. Also, when you remove this cup, it prevents it from leaking so that there's no leakage and it's a neater cup to remove. This cup also has a bulbous design, which is different than most menstrual cups. This cup also has a unique feature to help you fold. While you may not be able to see this on camera, there is little bumps right around here on the rim. According to the instructions, that's the proper place to fold the cup down. So you fold it from that rim, insert it, and release. One thing that I noticed with this cup is that it doesn't necessarily completely open when you insert it. It will sometimes stay sort of collapsed like this. It doesn't necessarily pop completely open. Now, according to the manufacturer's website, the Femi Cycle is designed to work without being completely opened. So that shouldn't be too much of a concern. I would consider this a somewhat firm cup at the top and fairly soft at the bottom. The reason I say it's somewhat firm at the top is because it does have that double rim, which makes it feel much firmer. With this cup, you could do the C-fold to insert it. You can also do the punch down fold, which is a little bit harder, makes the cup a little bit bigger to insert it. I have not been able to successfully do the origami fold with this cup, but we'll keep practicing. This cup comes with a really nice pouch. The pouch for the Femi Cycle is a bigger pouch. It's made of material. It has a snap on it to snap it shut, which makes it nice and easy. Shut. It is a larger pouch. One also has the Femi Cycle logo on the back. So it may not be the best cup to carry with you if you have a small handbag, because this could take up quite a bit of room. But overall, I think the pouch is really good, and the pouch is designed to fit two Femi Cycle menstrual cups if you would rather purchase two. Now, what is my opinion of this cup? From personal experience, this is definitely not my favorite cup. I found it sort of uncomfortable to use, and I think it's because of the bulbous design. When it was inserted, when it was partially collapsed, it was pretty comfortable. But as the day went on, I noticed it opened all the way. As it opened all the way, I became aware of feeling this cup. So I wasn't completely satisfied. I've used it from time to time, but it's definitely not one of my favorite menstrual cups. I would consider buying the teen version in the future, even though I'm not a teenager, to compare to this version as it's a smaller design altogether, thinking it might provide better comfort. Would I recommend this cup? Well, it depends what kind of experience you have with menstrual cups. If you're very experienced with menstrual cups and you just want to try it, I'd say go ahead and purchase it. But if you're a new user or you're just looking for one menstrual cup, this probably isn't the best fit for you. I would re recommend something like the Lily Cup or the Schoon Cup to be a first cup, or even if you just want to just purchase one cup. 
This one, I some people really like it, but I found a lot of complaints that it's just not very comfortable. And that was what I found from my personal experience. You, if you do want to purchase this cup, you can purchase it on Amazon, and I believe it retails for about $39.99. Well, that's all I have to say about the Femi Cycle today. Stay tuned for my next video, where I will be comparing the Femi Cycle to the Marula Cup, two cups that have an interesting design. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.